helpless defect knew that his best chance for survival lay with the facility's ventilation system. If he could just run to the vent, he might just make it out of there alive. I know you will find the defect. You never disappoint. Feeble Defect knew that if he were to survive, he would have to throw a bomb at whatever lay in his path. The young Defect spotted a spring bot ahead of him and knew that with this handy device in his arsenal, he could now defeat the deadliest of forces, gravity. The hopeless Defect had to throw a spring bot, but where and how? Get back here and let's settle this. Warbot to Warbot. Oh no, water. That was a little close for my liking. Suddenly, the defect spotted a power bot. This device could power up a variety of machines, but where should he throw it? <laughs> You're like really good at adding drama, man. Thank you, Shiv. I pride myself on my pension for storytelling. What seems to be the problem, Victor? He won't get away from me, Chairman. I've got him right where I want him. Suddenly, the defect spotted a power bot. This device could power up a variety of machines, but where should he throw it? You're like really good at adding drama, man. Thank you, Shiv. I pride myself on my pension for storytelling. What seems to be the problem, Victor? You won't get away from me, Chairman. I've got him right where I want him.
think you can run from me? Not that route again. Get back here, you miserable defect! Try out running this! I'm gonna rip you apart, sprocket by sprocket! Water! Computer, set coordinates for the Galactic Ranger home base. Destination set. We will never make it. But hey, what are you gonna do? Oh dear. I'll never be a ranger. <sighs> what? Vector shell damage. Sister board appears to be intact. I must get to Alero City. Dad. They are in danger. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, who's in danger? An army is coming. I must warn them. Hang on. Slow down. You've been in a crash. What do you say we get you back to my garage? I'll run a diagnostic and have you fixed up in no time. Thank you. I appreciate the assistance. It's no problem. So, what do I call you? I suppose my proper designation is Warbot Defect B54296. Uh, maybe I'll just call you Clank. My name's Ratchet. Uh, up and down. Yeah, there you go. You're a natural. A million thoughts race through Ratchet's head. Could he repair this diminutive Warbot? Would it be the key to the adventure he craved? Did he leave the proto engine on in the garage? The answer to all these questions was yes. All right, hang on. I'll get us back to the garage. Large gaps were child's play to Ratchet. All he would need to get across is a trusty swing shot and a little bravado. Fortunately for our furry hero, 
A conveniently placed crate provided Ratchet with a combustor. Nice! A combustor! Ratchet basked in the freedom of being able to switch weapons whenever he felt like it. Perhaps you could shoot something to open the door. My sensors indicate there is a switch across the way that can be activated with a combustor shot. Impressive shooting. shooting. Nice work. Grim, listen to me. I want you to lock the garage doors and then head down into the shelter. I'll be there as soon as I can. Copy that, Ratchet. Confused and alone, he scoured the Kizzle Plateau for signs of nanotech. I think that's all of them. Dropship? Correct. Model X60 to be exact. Also known as the Dropship of Death. Great. some defect.
Jim. Coast is clear. Can you open up? Ratchet, why is Zony's name just exploded? Sorry about that, Grim. Listen, get my tools ready. I just found something in the desert I need to look at. Interesting. What kind of factory is this? This? No, oh, this is just a garage. Lived here since I was a kid. Come on, let's get you fixed up. Once they were safe, Clank explained Drek's plan to attack the Hall of Heroes. With the Galactic Rangers out of the equation, Ratchet knew he had to help, even though neither he nor Clank had the upper body strength necessary for hero work. I can totally help. Oh, I could not ask a civilian to get involved in something so dangerous. Well, no, I'm not just a civilian. The Rangers are actually my, uh, friends. Why do you think I have so many pictures of them? But why are you not in any of them? Well, someone had to take the picture, right? I mean, come on. I even have a ship. It disassembles so it can infiltrate enemy strongholds. <laughs> so what do you say? That's strange. I'm picking up something from Navalis. It appears to be some sort of distress signal, but it is being jammed using a Blargian signal dampener. Don't worry. The computer would have told us if we were in any real danger. Fatal crash imminent. Would you like to record your last will and testament? Admittedly, that's not super promising. Well, it's damaged, but I've fixed worse. Come on, maybe there's someone in town who can help us. 